before operating the machine, thoroughly read safety and operation information in the operator's manual. The active alarm screen opens by default when selecting the Diagnostic Information button from the home page menus. The Active Alarms button also opens the screen from other Diagnostic Information screens. Buttons for the Information screens will display in the menu area, such as Active Alarms, Diagnostic Readings, Calibration, Transmission Tow Mode, Off Button, and the Home Page. The Active Alarm screen displays all current active diagnostic trouble codes, associated alarms, and instruction screens. The page number and total number of alarms are shown with the most recent alarms displayed first. The alarm severity or priority, the control unit and trouble code are all displayed. Next and previous icons allow the operator to scroll through the alarm screens. Press the Diagnostic Readings button to display the Diagnostic Readings screen. Select the drop-down box to display a drop-down list of available subsystem information screens. Scroll up or down the list as necessary to display the entire list. Selecting any of these subsystem titles will open up a series of screens with specific information such as switch status, sensor data, and other settings or values. The screen number and total number of screens are shown. Move through the screens using the Next or Previous buttons and the Cancel button to return to the drop-down menu list. Press the Calibrations button to display the calibration screen. Select the drop-down box to display a drop-down list of available subsystem calibration screens. Scroll up or down the list as necessary to display the entire list. Press to select the desired calibration from the list. Screens will provide information as to when the calibration may be necessary, such as after service, adjustment, or part replacement. In addition, the screen will display the first step or prerequisites for execution of the calibration process. Press the Enter button to initiate the calibration. Follow on-screen instructions to complete the calibration. For example, some calibrations may prompt the operator to press the Off menu button to allow the calibration to begin. The Transmission Tow Mode button displays the Tow Mode information screens and the Tow Mode Request checkbox. The engine must be running and the operator in the seat to allow tow mode to function. For more detailed information, refer to the operator's manual.